So there are three main things that you're missing out on by not being data-driven as an organization. The first is the ability to have a clear understanding of what happened, why something happened, and what might happen. So if we're losing customers, then we might look at, well, what kind of customers are we losing? When did that happen? And then unpick why might that be? Is it because they don't like the product anymore? Is it because the return process is too long? And then we might look at what might happen going forward. So what kind of products might we sell to those customers, as an example? The second is around risk management and, and threat management. So having data um, and insights at the heart of an organization allows you to better understand and highlight risks. So are there new entrants into our market that mean that, that some of our product line is threatened? Having that data, having that understanding and using that to help um, apply to the situation allows us to better manage the risks, the threats to our organization. And the third is around talent retention, attraction and retention. And by having an organization that's data guided, because there's an expectation amongst lots of employees, generations of employees that have grown up with technology, with data, with insights through social media, um, through, through fitness trackers and those sorts of things, when they come into business, they expect this. So having an organization that is data driven improves your employee value proposition and allows you to bring in good talent into the organization.